Excuse me. Uh huh. Excuse me, Tiong. I wonder. I wonder if you could have your signature on this form, please. So Tiong could be someone who has been filling up forms. Um, for example, like this forms, uh, but there's no signature. So excuse me. Could I have? I wonder if you could have your signature here. Okay. So that's one uh, form of using. Um, excuse me, Miss. Do you mind telling me how to get to MRSM Kuala Kubu Baru? That was your question, asking for direction. Okay. Do you mind telling me how to get to MRSM Kuala Kubu Baru? So we are asking for directions. I always use this when I go to new places. I'll go to the uh, fuel filling station. Okay. There is no excuse me here. Hello, boss. But we accept. Do we accept? Um, will you be insulted if they do this to you? Do you feel insulted if people say, hey, hello boss, can you, do you feel insulted? Do you find it is wrong? No, why? Because it has been commonly used in our culture and we accepted it as it's okay. Right? It's okay. Uh, but uh, honestly, we don't call anybody, anybody, anyone. Yeah, you are giving him a, a, That's why, actually it's to show respect Okay, to show respect But in the use of language, it's not correct It's not correct to use it that way You don't say hello to someone and asking them to do something Yeah um, Hello is a greeting word To say, um, it's, it's, it's a greeting word um, For introduction of each other Yeah So, it's not correctly used in this manner it's fine, it's okay in the culture, but it's not correct, um, correctly used. Okay, now, this is what we norm normally do. Would you mind? Is it okay? Sure. Can you come? Yes, of course. Yes, of course. So, we... Sorry? Uh, no, 1F, sorry. 1F. Okay. Uh, so we always use contracting form of statements when we respond to our uh, to our sp to to speakers speaking to us. Okay, we when we agree, when we accept, we always say sure, yes, of course. Can you come to the uh, to the meeting this afternoon? Yes, of course. No problem. There's another word. No problem. Okay. Um, could you come to uh, could you come to the gathering this evening? Why? Yes, of course. So why? Why have you heard something about me not coming? That's the question. And the the assurance is yes, of course I'm coming. Okay. So when when you hear, when you hear people saying why? Yes, of course I'm coming. Meaning the question is why? Anyone saying I'm not coming? That's what it means. Yeah. Um, do you mind? Would you mind? The response will be, if you, if you are okay, you will say, no, not at all. I'm more than willing to help. But if you say, do you mind? And the person say, yes, don't go further. That's it. <laughs> Full stop. Because he doesn't like it. Okay? Um, do you mind if I um, sit here for a while? Uh, yes, I do mind. <laughs> Meaning, please go. <laughs> okay, so you be very careful with these responses, um, and we should be able to to detect the meaning very quickly. But most of the time, it will be, do you mind? Would you mind? It will be no, no problem. Okay, unless you are unable to 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 offer your uh, services, uh, then you will say. Uh, normally you would say no, uh, you would say yes, I'm, I'm so sorry, I have to be at somewhere, somewhere else at that particular time. Okay? So the speaker will not be offended. Uh, definitely, another response that we always use. To what kind of questions, what kind of statements? Will you attend the meeting today? Will you attend the meeting today? Yes. 
Yeah. Wait, some, something which is mandatory, you have to, to have that response. Okay, mandatory statements, that will be the response. Do I have to take these capsules? Definitely, otherwise you will end up in bed. Uh, so you must take those tablets. <coughs> Absolutely. Do you understand? Can you understand this session? Yes? Absolutely. Okay, now these are responses to some questions. I'll be happy to. Okay, do you mind? Yeah, could you please? I'll be happy to is a, a response. Meaning you will do it. Okay, these are positive responses. Um, by all means, what does that mean? By all means is also a mandatory statement. Okay, it must be carried out. It must be in that manner, by all means. Okay? Um, okay? Okay is okay. Okay means okay. It means yes. Okay? Uh, when people say okay, it's yes. No hal. <laughs> no hal is, 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 uh, is, um, is our local term. No problem. Okay? No hal lah. Okay lah. Okay, this is our local terms. Except yes. Sorry? With pleasure. Yeah, some more. Um, these are just uh, samples. There are plenty more of terms that we could use. My pleasure, meaning yes, of course, no problem. If I say my pleasure, meaning I will do it for you, no problem. Okay? Uh, so there are many other terms which we can refer to. Um, formal settings, we would use these statements. Okay, in formal settings, we would use these statements. I would be pleased to, I would be delighted to, these are some of the vocabulary we could use. I would be happy to, I would be grateful to, thank you, I appreciate it. I'm honored to. Honored meaning uh, if you invite me to a special function of yours, I would respond, yes, thank you very much. I'm honored to be there. Meaning I am I find that you know it's it's right you have invited me. I am very, very grateful to what you have done for me. I'm honored. It's my pleasure. Okay, it's my pleasure, meaning uh, you can I can give you all the time that you need for me to be there. Okay, formal setting. Uh, if you refuse, if you decline, these are some statements. I'm sorry. Okay, I simply cannot make it. I wish I could, but I can't. I'm sorry, I don't think I can make it next week. Okay, um, I'm not free to come for tutorial um, next week. I'm awfully sorry. Okay, when you say I'm awfully sorry, it's, it shows that you are very, very sorry. Okay, but you see, I was, I was away in London last week. So, I just can't be here. I would, I would like to say yes, but I... When people say, I would like to say yes, meaning no. Okay? When you ask a person for something, you say, um, I would like to say yes, but... With the but, you know it's a, it's a no. And what should you say? It's okay. No hal. <laughs> okay? It's okay. Um, I would really like to help, but when there is a but in the in, in this statement, it means otherwise. But you have that intention of wanting to help. You have the intention of saying yes, but you are busy somewhere else. Okay, a very nice way to decline. And uh, the person who requests will also not feel offended. He will say, yeah, what to do? Since you have to go, then I'll just have to do without you, okay? So I would like to say yes, but I can't be here on that particular time. I would really like to help, but I have another assignment somewhere else in, in another place, okay? 